Summon the Heroes, a patriotic presentation of an American hero or heroes. Today, the 9-11 search and rescue dogs and their handlers. It is hard to imagine that the tragedy of 9-11 is almost a generation gone. Out of America's great loss of lives have come continued heroes and heroic stories. Britagna and Denise are two of them. Within hours of the towers coming down, first responders and EMTs from around the nation were on their way to New York City. Britagna and Denise were part of the Texas Task Force One sent to the World Trade Center site in Lower Manhattan. They would spend 10 days at that horrific scene searching through the rubble for human remains. When they were not actively in their search and rescue mode, they found themselves spending time providing comfort and emotional support to others involved in the same tasks. You should know now that Denise was the handler of Britannia, a golden retriever. They were one of almost 100 teams of handlers and dogs that converged on Ground Zero. They worked long shifts with rest in between. The dogs often wore little booties to protect their paws from glass and other harmful debris from the trade centers. Labradors and Retrievers were the most common breed. By the 10th anniversary reunion at Ground Zero, only 13 of the nearly 100 dogs were still alive. We now introduce and salute a few of them. It's Riley and Abby Tikva Ricky Jake, Red, and Tracker. The original search and rescue dogs are gone now. Britannia was the last to pass away. She left us on May 7, 2016, at the age of 15. There have been, there have been honored by their home towns and their states, New York City, and their nation. Today, we realize that you do not need to be human to do heroic feats and be a hero. Ladies and, ladies and gentlemen, representing all of the dogs and all of the 9-11 handlers, Britannia. <laughs>